Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hi. Hopefully all of you in a good condition and we can continue our class as usual. Okay, today I would like to uh, explain a uh, linked list algorithm as a uh, previous class already explained about the basic of uh, or the concept of a uh, linked list. Hopefully you can understand uh, the concept of a uh, linked list. Okay, uh, let's talk, continue with our class. Okay, um, there are two types of linked list uh, algorithm in Java, which is uh, which are predefined linked list, and another one is self-defined. Okay, if you want uh, intend to implementing a self-defined uh, predefined linked list, which uh, it is already redefined in Java library, you can. Um, uh, assess from there. Okay, Java provide class linked list for implementing and manipulating linked list in Java package. Uh, you can uh, use uh, implement java.util.star library. In uh, Java library, it uh, implement a doubly linked list type. Okay, doubly linked list type. Okay, meanwhile, for the self-defined linked list, uh, which is uh, this is the actually our focus for our class, self-defined linked list. Okay, means a programmer can also create self-defined linked list by defining own linked list class to represent the node and linked list structure. For the self-defined, we will use a singly linked list uh, version. Okay, singly linked list version. Okay, so uh, for now on, I will focusing on uh, self-defined linked list. Okay, uh, to implementing a self-defined linked list, we need uh, three classes, and another one is optional classes, which uh, counted as all, right? So the the main uh, needs are three classes. This is a compulsory uh, for the basic. Okay, if you are dealing with the object. You need another class, okay? Optional class to define the object. Okay, uh, let's look uh, the three classes. Okay, the first class is a node class. Okay, the node class will define the structure of each node. Okay, the second class is linked list class. This this uh, class will define the methods in linked list. Another one is a main application class. Okay, main application class is to implement linked list on any data. Another one is a uh, optional class is to define a uh, Object, okay. Our project base uh, mean uh, relate with our project. For example, if we want uh, to process a student data, then we need to create a student class, or we can, uh, or else it can be any uh, class, okay. In order to define details of related object, okay. Um, we go through uh, the first class, which is a node class. Okay, look at the structure or class diagram. Uh, this class consists of um, two fields or two data member, which is a data and next. Okay, actually, uh, this class is representing the uh, structure of node. As we learned before, the structure of node consists of two parts or two partition. Firstly, data, and secondly, uh, is the next next means a uh, uh, address of next node. Okay. So uh, so this class consists uh, consists of uh, the field is two uh, uh, data and next and the uh, method it is uh, it's a constructor of the node class and uh, to get object. Okay, get object and, and next. However, uh, for the get object or accessing the object, will be uh, specifying in a uh, linked link class. Okay, next, uh, this is the definition of a uh, node class. Okay, node class consists of two of uh, two data members. Okay, firstly, data. Data is an object defined as object. Secondly, next. Next is defined as a class node. Okay. <clears throat> So actually, uh, this class will be implement uh, the, be implemented by uh, class linked list. Okay, so in linked list, we can see uh, 
the utility, it, uh, it will utilize a node. Okay, as we can see here, uh, the link list class structure. So there are three class, uh, three field for the class uh, link list. Okay, first, last, and current. All of uh, these uh, three uh, are type class, not class. Okay, first is a not class, last is not class, and current is not class. Okay, and the methods. Method consists of constructor. Uh, is empty to check whether the list is empty and the rest is the operation uh, related to the operation uh, that we can perform on a uh, link list for example insert at front insert at back remove from back front remove from back get first another one is uh, get next okay okay um hopefully you can um um see as well the Return value and the uh, parameter for every method. Okay, for example, for insert at front, it uh, not return any value. It is stated as void and uh, it has a parameter passing one parameter. Same uh, with the insert at back, uh, return uh, void and receive one parameter. Remove from front, it uh, return the object and not uh, receive any parameter. Remove from back also the same with the remove from front. The one is get first a uh, return object and also with the get next. Okay, we can uh, as the uh, title the uh, function uh, method name we can uh, predict what's the what's the function of the every method. For example, insert at front. It's really it is it's to insert at the front of the list. Okay. Okay. Inside yeah. back, actually, it, it, it uh, intend to perform uh, insert new data at the end of the list. Remove from front. Actually, uh, you can use to delete element from front. And uh, while for the remove from back, we can use to delete element from back. And the get first uh, and get next. Uh, both are both are method used to assess the uh, node in the list okay. get first we can get the first node and the get, next, uh, get next we can access uh, next node okay let's look the, the details okay there are six, uh, met, uh, six seven seven method okay okay uh, the first method okay um, we just go to the method not uh, the method and then i think uh, we, we can skip the constructor of the link list. Okay, we uh, jump to the uh, is empty. Okay, is empty. It's empty actually to make sure the list is empty or not having any node. Okay, firstly, uh, before we uh, proceed to any uh, operation, to perform any operation, we need to make sure uh, the list is not empty or is empty. Okay, we need to use this method first. Okay, this means uh, this method always use will be used uh, by others uh, method in the linked list class. Okay, so this method actually uh, to make sure the list is empty by uh, as we can see in the uh, coding of this method. Okay, just to make sure the first uh, is empty, boolean is empty, return first equal to null. Okay. Okay, what is, is done? Uh, what what it has done in the this method is um, uh, it will return uh, now. Um, I mean, uh, uh, it will get the now. Is it now or not? If the first is now, then return true. Otherwise, it return false. Okay. Okay, let's look um, the second method uh, which didn't mean uh, the second method is the operation both the operation which is uh, insert at front okay which uh, insert at front as we um, see the function of this method is actually is attempt to insert new node at the front of the list we have the world list of uh, in the list then the new node or new data we want to place at the front. Okay, that's it. Okay, for example, 
For example, uh, look at the algorithm first. So this algorithm, uh, this method, uh, no return, no return value, void, insert at front, receive one parameter, object. Okay, so firstly, it will um, create new node, which is uh, the new node that will store the new data. Okay, so the new data will be stored into the uh, new node, new node uh, object. Okay, firstly, so as we can see here, um, okay, I try to use uh, no. uh, to change the uh, better color yeah, blue. Okay. Yes, a new node. Okay, the new node uh, that store X data. This object, object, this content, uh, contain. Uh, New data, then the, this data will insert into the new node. Okay, that's it. So next, it will check uh, the list is empty or not. As I mentioned earlier, we can we will use always use this method in order to make sure the list is not empty. If the, if, uh, the list is empty, then it will uh, more easier lah actually. Okay, we just um, assign new node to first and a new node to the last. Yeah, otherwise, if uh, the list is not empty. For example, we uh, have one list. For example, here look at this. Okay, uh, our list consists of uh, three nodes, three data, A, B, C. Okay, the first node, uh, the address is one thousand. The second node, one thousand five hundred, and C, uh, the second third, third node is one thousand two hundred. Okay, the first node, the first uh, node will, will be point to the first uh, node in the list, and the last uh, node. Or the uh, last data member in English will point the last not in the uh, English. Okay. As I mentioned uh, earlier, there are three uh, data type data members in a uh, linked list uh, class: first, first, last, and current. Okay. In this method, we also we just use a two, two, uh, two uh, first and last only. Okay. So, uh, next. Okay. If the node is not empty, then uh, we go to a second second op uh, operation. We can uh, we can step, which is uh, we want to get as we can see here. We want to get the address of uh, first node. Okay, so the first example, the address of uh, first is uh, one thousand. Then store into new node. Okay, the current uh, next of a uh, new node is now, so we will replace with the uh, first node. Okay, so get uh, 1000 store into next of new node. Then we need to copy um, from a, a new node. So from now on, the new node will become the first node and it will connect to a uh, second node. Okay, the second node, the current uh, previous uh, first node will be become the second node, as we can see here. Okay, so the first will uh, copy uh, the address of uh, first first node, uh, uh, new node. Then uh, it will point the first point to new node as the first. Okay, lastly. Okay, lastly, you can see uh, like this. Okay, the new node with a uh, value x previously, we add new uh, the new node with the value x will become the first node, and the first uh, will point to the x. Okay. Okay, next. Okay, I want to find uh, how to clear. Okay, clear. Okay, insert new item done. Okay, we already successfully insert new node at the front. Okay, for the wrap up, there are um, 
three steps actually. Firstly, uh, create new node. Okay, create new node. Secondly, um, assign um, first node, current first node to the new node. Assign the address of a uh, current uh, new node. Current uh, first node to a uh, new node. And then secondly, thirdly, I copy uh, the data from a uh, new node as right now the new node become the first node into the first okay so um, uh, so the first can uh, point to the our new uh, first node okay finally we get we got uh, this list okay as the new list the new node uh, become uh, the new the first node okay that's it done Okay, next, uh, the next method, uh, public void insert at back. Okay, this uh, method uh, not return any value and it receive one parameter. As we can see, we can see the address, the, uh, the name of a uh, method insert at back. So we can imagine that uh, the new node will insert at the end of the list. Okay, currently we have uh, this list. After insert uh, at front, so we have uh, this list. Okay, it consists of uh, four nodes, X, A, B, and C. Okay, now we want to uh, demonstrate uh, how to use uh, insert that. Okay, look at the algorithm first. So, uh, the algorithm start with uh, create a new node. Okay, insert node. So, the, the data from the object from the passing address will assign to the new node. Okay, so it become an uh, example. We have one new data, it's Y. Okay, then create uh, the new node consists of y and without uh, address next address without next still like uh, still now okay as uh, usual as uh, insert at front we also need to check uh, to make sure the node is not empty we using uh, is empty and then if uh, in case uh, the node is not empty then we can proceed to the uh, this uh, second step which is uh, assigning a new node okay new node Okay, the new node, the address of new node is 3000 assigned to the last. So right now we want to the um, uh, add new node and uh, the new node will become the last node. Okay. Okay, so it needs to get uh, the address of the new uh, new node assigned to uh, the last dot next. Last dot next will be uh, <clears throat> Okay, last uh, the new node assigned to last dot next. So it means uh, you want to uh, we uh, try to add, uh, join the current last the current last which is contain C to join with the new node X. Okay, so we need uh, address of new node then uh, copy to last dot next uh, so that uh, this the last the previous last will will link to the new node. Okay. Okay, next, uh, copy the, the data from a new node to last as uh, you want to um, uh, make, make sure the last uh, node will point, always point to the last node. Okay, so the last node uh, right now is uh, our new node become as a last node. Okay, so lastly, you can see here, our uh, Y become the last node and the last uh, node will point to the Y. Okay. So the previous last will point to Y as uh, it will copy the address of uh, new last Y as uh, content not Y here. Okay, uh, as, as as stated here is uh, there are three steps. Firstly, create new node with Y and with the address. Then secondly, um, copy the address of a new node to um, the previous uh, node, previous last node. Uh, in order to uh, link the previous last node with the new node, okay? And lastly, copy the address of new node, store into the last, as, as, as we want to make sure the last node will always point to the last node in the list, okay? Hopefully you can understand, or you can um, look at the number, I, I stayed here. You can go one by one, step by step, in order to get uh, the 
picture uh, this step okay okay uh, let's um, proceed to next method which is uh, remove from front yeah okay, um, we are already done uh, for the insert uh, which is uh, consists of two method insert in at front insert at back okay now we proceed to uh, remove or delete data okay for the delete also we uh, considering to remove from front and also remove from back okay, firstly uh, remove from front yeah look at the um, uh, coding okay remove from front uh, re we will re uh, return uh, met the method we return uh, object type and not receive any parameters okay First of all, we need to declare one uh, object, remove item type object. Okay, make sure the list is not empty. Then, if uh, next, um, okay, okay, we we want to start. Okay, the first step is get the first data as we want to remove from front. So we need uh, to get. We want we need to get the uh, first node data of the first node. Okay, the data of the first node. Uh, needs to uh, store into uh, object remove item okay as we have first okay, first step get the x then store into the remove item okay next we met, uh, want to make sure first not equal uh, to last if uh, first equal to last means it's only we only have one node uh, okay if we have only one node then we, uh, we just uh, remove the node then it become a null okay no uh, no 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 item in the list okay this in this case uh, only one uh, node in the list okay otherwise if we have a uh, others not then you go to the else okay the else uh, the next step is second second step is uh, to get the first dot next which one is the first dot, get, dot next it means you want to get the second the address of the second node okay in the list okay as we want to uh, remove uh, the first node in the list then um, after we remove the first node then the second uh, node in the currently will become the first not first uh become the first okay which is the replacing replace the current first okay so the second will be become the first so we want we need to that get the address of a second second not okay to get the second uh, address of the second not we can access first or next then we can get a uh, address of second not then assign to the first okay so this first will uh point to the second not okay as we can see here the first will uh, point to the second node which is uh, which contain a okay as we remove the uh, node with uh, uh, data x okay so uh, what we uh, uh, need to uh, how about the x okay actually the x we will return okay we need uh, we do not uh, uh, remove uh, completely remove Okay, but we still uh, return the value of x, then uh, we can perform uh, something at the main method. Okay, so the data is still uh, under our control actually. Okay, so for wrap up, there are two main steps in this uh, method. Okay, firstly, uh, store the data, the remove uh, item. We want to remove uh, the first data, uh, first uh, node. So store the first not item, not first not data into the remove item. Okay. Secondly, join or point the first not first first uh, first point to the second not as we want to remove the first not first current not. Okay. Finally, uh, first we'll point to the second not. Okay. That's it. Remove done. Okay. Okay, we uh, move to we are moving to the second remove uh, method, which is um, remove from back. Okay, there is um, a bit different uh, compared to uh, remove from front. I mean, uh, we need to remove uh, from back. Okay. 
Okay, so let's look. Uh, looks like um, the quotes are more uh, longer compared to remove from back front. Okay. Actually, we want to remove the uh, the uh, the uh, last method, last uh, not in the list. Okay. So uh, let looks let looks uh, the coding first. Okay. Firstly, uh, create object of remove item that object. Okay. Because we want we need this object because we want to return the remove uh, data. Okay. We want not completely destroy uh, the data. Okay, secondly, check the empty with uh, the check the, uh, to make sure the list not empty. Next, um, okay, uh, start, start our step for performing the remove from back. Firstly, we need to get the remove node data of the remove node. Okay, we can access through last dot data so, uh, uh, as we can see here. Uh, number one, okay, get the remove item Y. Or, uh, why? Okay, store into the remove item. Why? Okay, next, uh, check whether the first uh, equal to last. Okay, otherwise, no, no. Uh, the first equal to last mean uh, there, there is only one uh, not in the list. Okay, next, if the, there is uh, there are more uh, not in the list, then it will go to jump to else. So next, the second step is uh, uh, copy. Uh, first, okay. Now we want to find the second last. As we already known, uh, the last um, uh, not is uh, the that containing y data. Now we want to find the second last, which is uh, containing a uh, c. Okay, because you want uh, after we remove the last not, then uh, the not that containing the uh, second last not, which is a uh, containing c, will become the last. Okay. So we need to find, um, find uh, the address of uh, the second last node. Okay, so we need to uh, um, use uh, looping in order to get the second node. Second last node. Okay. Okay. In order to find the second last node, firstly we start with uh, assigning uh, first to the current. We, uh, okay. This is. Uh, Different before uh, from uh, previous uh, methods. As uh, this method actually, we will implementing a uh, third um, data members in uh, linked list, which is uh, first, current, and last. Uh, we need to use a current because we want to find the uh, current. Uh, we want to find the second last node in the list. Okay. Okay. Let's look how uh, we can get the second last. Okay, firstly we set uh, the first uh, as a current. Then we need to um, looping in order to, uh, uh, we need to assess one by one of the node in order to get the second last. Okay, the condition uh, current net not equal to last. Okay, which mean uh, you want to uh, loop until the second last not until the last, okay. Uh, so after uh, second last, it, it stop. Then we can get the address of second last. Okay, that's it. So um, as, uh, firstly, we set a first as a, a current. Then we repeat uh, for the repeat until it will find the second last. Okay. For example, here the current uh, assigned with uh, first, same with the first. Okay. Secondly, it will repeat uh, for the next node. Okay, the current will fill with the second node, and uh, next it will current the sec uh, second last, and after it find the second last, it stop. Okay, then we can get the second last node. Then we can get the address of the second last. Okay. Okay. Yeah, after we find the second last, we get the current.next. Okay, current.next means um, the address of second last. Okay, then it will store to the current. So the current will point the second last. Okay. Okay, now, next step. You want to um, trans uh, transform the current to become the last. Okay, now after the loop, we can get the second last. 
then the second last uh, will be assigned as a last. Okay, so the last um, not the last will be point to the second last which containing C. Okay. Okay. Lastly, the last dot next uh, means uh, the last dot next. Okay, will uh, assign to now which uh, it will uh, unlink un with the the previous last node. Okay, unlink set to now. Okay, lastly, uh, we can see this diagram after remove. Then uh, last we point to the C as the uh, last node, and C will uh, have a next address with uh, now. Okay, so the Y is removed. The the while still uh, the data of Y will be written to the calling part method. Okay. Next, uh, we proceed to assessing the how to assess the method that can assess uh, node in the link links. Okay, there are two types of uh, assessing method. Okay, get first and get next. Okay, uh, firstly we proceed to to the first uh, uh, get uh, method, which is uh, get first. Okay, the get first method actually uh, we want to get the first uh, node of the in the link list. Okay, item, the item, the first item, which is. It's quite, it's quite uh, easy actually because uh, we, we already have a uh, first. First always a uh, point to the first node. Okay, so what we going to do is um, just uh, assigning uh, first. Okay, first to the current. Uh, we, we have to use a current. But if we, we do not need, we do not want to use the current, we can also, we just use a uh, first as well. First only. Okay. Uh, this uh, other uh, other way, we just uh, we are assigning a first current. Okay, or um, the um, okay. Uh, actually, we need to we have to use a current. Okay, because um, in the link list, in order to assess the others data, we need to set uh, first get first we we need to call get first first okay after that we can use uh, get next and that's why it use a uh, current here okay so we need, we have to use current so we have we need to assign first as current copy first become a current so both of the first and current we point to the same node which is the first node then return the current data current data then we return the data of the first node which is a okay so we get the data uh, then uh, return to the method calling method okay next to get next okay we want to get next data okay to get next data uh, is, uh, is actually we need uh, to um, um, call the get next gets first first okay we need to uh, call get first before we uh, call the get next. Okay. So um, okay. So to get the next data, uh, as uh, we uh, call the get get first data, it, we, the current will point to the first node, and after that, it's, it is more easier to uh, get the next data as we can uh, see the step here. The car, uh, we just get the uh, address of the next of the uh, containing next uh, value of the next uh, the first node current dot next, which is we get the second uh, node current address of the second node assigned to the current. Then the current will point to the second node. Okay. Then we re get the data of the current uh, current node. Okay. As we can see here, then we can get the uh, uh, second uh, the next node containing B and uh, if we want to get the other uh, data the next the others next data we uh, we need to uh, um, call the next get next again uh, that's mean um, if you want to access all the data in the link list we need to um, dealing with uh, looping okay which mean uh, in the loop we will um, perform or call get next uh, again and again until find the uh, last data. 
okay until find a certain condition okay okay um okay you already done or uh, i already done uh, explaining all the all the methods in the link list it's containing um, seven methods okay it's empty it's at front it's at back remove from front remove from back get first and get next uh, hopefully you can um, um, try to understand all of uh, this method okay this method actually you need to understand essentially essentially it's a uh, it's a must okay it's a must for you to understand me understand uh, the every method in order to implement in a link list okay that's all for uh, now for this ses session okay and sign off from now thank you assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh